Welcome everyone, I'm Fausto Carnevale, I'm an Italian accountant and today we are going to talk about how if you are a seven figures entrepreneur how you can move in Italy risk-free what do I mean risk-free? of course we are talking about taxes today so without risks, without having the Agenzia delle Entrate following you without having the Guardia di Finanza inspecting you because unfortunately Italy is not like USA it is not a quite friendly country for entrepreneurs they assume and I really don't like this they assume that if you're an entrepreneur you are uh, uh, let's say avoiding to pay taxes not everyone but you and I may know that uh, us, when you have assets when you have uh, money in bank accounts in shares in crypto or uh, in index like the ATF which I'm actively investing in ATF the main purpose the main concern is when you move to another country is okay I want to save taxes I want to work I want to maybe open a company in the in Italy maybe using the regime forfettario or using another regime but in the back of your mind I'm sure you are thinking how can I protect my asset because the more asset you have the more you sh you shift and you think how can I protect my asset I'm doing this video today and I want you to remind that if you need a more tailored consultancy you can text us at the email provided in the description of the video I wanted to just say to start this video uh, don't worry don't worry why because in Italy there are specific way to declare your assets abroad and your share abroad in particular in Italy uh, there are two taxes the IVA which we can write IVA and IVAFE so basically those are taxes on assets owed abroad the IVA fair is for bank account but I already did a video of those two taxes and the IVA is of financial activity and then we have the RWW box in your tax declaration when you can declare also the shares of the company that you are abroad so given those quick information that as I said I have already told in other videos what I wanted to remark today is not uh, how to declare how to do this is the logic that the entrepreneur especially especially seven plus figures entrepreneur should adopt when you move to Italy or maybe if you are an entrepreneur you are on six figures you're you still may have uh, huge assets abroad so today let's see a bit more in deep the mindset that you should have so first of all in Italy uh, when you move your tax declaration you have to declare for the income produced in Italy second thing and uh, I will invite you to watch again our video uh, of the estero vestizione do not forget that you can't can not open a company for instance in Dubai where you live in Italy because is basically what you're saying what you're doing is to avoid taxes in Italy you're just evading taxes but suppose that you have a, a real estate company operating in the USA because the, the houses they are uh, let's say in the USA then you move to Italy of course you have to manage the your houses your real estates with a, a company in United States or Canada or UK or for example Australia so those are not estero vestizione those are not uh, considered a company estero vestizione is when you create and I do a quick remind here but I did also a video about, the, about that estero vestizione is the process when you open intentionally a company in another state most of the time a limited responsibility company in order to save taxes therefore the Italian government as any other government would do they say you can't do it because 
otherwise you are in Italy, you work in Italy and you cannot escape taxes. Imagine if everyone would do like this. Imagine! Imagine that nobody would pay taxes in Italy. <laughs> I'm opening a company in Dubai. Mm, this is the classic example and a lot of entrepreneurs fall in this example of estero vestizione. But today, I mean, not the proper video, but I just wanted to make a quick reminder and I wanted to say, stay calm. If you want to move to Italy, if you have and in the most of the cases we we saw with our clients that those those are the, the main concerns because they have houses asset bank accounts shares companies and also other financial like crypto so the main concerns are again especially especially for companies houses bank accounts and crypto cryptocurrency huge portfolios of crypto fortunately because then there are people who say, oh, in Italy you there is a slow system. And I always say, okay, calm, stay calm, relax, because in Italy we are evolving also. The thing is, if you don't speak Italian, if you don't know a good Italian accountant, you think that it's a mess. Because you maybe heard only some not qualified people. I'm here to tell you, don't worry, because if you, have, if you are concerned about those five you, you are an entrepreneur, you have assets abroad, companies, shares, you invest like me in ETFs. Don't worry, because in Italy there are proper ways to, in, to declare those things in your declaration at the end of the, of the year. As persona physica I'm talking today, eh? I'm not talking about if you already have a company. I'm not talking, sorry, about your company established in Italy. I'm talking about like you, physical person, who moved to Italy. So that is very, very important to remind. Again, I hope that with the Howard's videos, uh, with all the videos that we made, you can uh, gain more knowledge. Because at the end of the day, I'm inviting you to study our videos deeply understand to deeply understand we are not here to do funny videos we are not here to just complain I, as i said in the previous video next week i don't complain i never complain i work i put to work in my project in my business in my life but you need to study the video you need to study our videos and understand the logic because what we do, how we help our clients. We can help normally only clients who already studied a bit our video. So again, I'm here today just to remark this importance of not worrying about if you are an entrepreneur, you have several ways to declare your asset and stake and, and you can uh, finally move to Italy without worry. If you liked the video today, I will invite you to subscribe to the channel and if you need further assistance because of course today I'm talking in general you can contact us in email in the description below and we can do a private consultancy together in order to guide you further before moving to Italy and when I mean when I say guide you further I also mean giving you the support of a certified accountant in Italy an accountant who will speak English and uh, who can properly support you. So, until next time, Fausto Carnevale from Esentaxa, the number one channel for people who want to move to Italy, tax-wise. Until next time again, enjoy your staying in Italy.